What's going on everyone? This is Dom and today we're checking out some epic tech for your car all of which is under 20 bucks and first up we are taking a look at a pretty dope smartphone mount. This is the True Love's in-car vent mount and what this does is it actually attaches to the AC vents inside of your car and allows you to attach your smartphone in a wide variety of angles and the best part here is that it's completely resizable. You can easily grab it from the sides and pull it apart to make room for most any smartphone out out there. It has some little rubber nubs on the back side here that easily attach to just about any kind of AC vent in a car and like I said it's pretty awesome and the whole thing is very sturdy as well. As for the durability this thing is made up of mostly metal which I find to be pretty awesome and like I said it's 20 bucks and you really can't go wrong and I'll leave a link to this and everything else mentioned in this video in the description. Next up we're taking a look at the Urbo power bank car charger. Now you've seen these kind of things before where you plug it into your car and you can hook up some smartphones via USB on the other end but this has another trick up its sleeve it actually has a built-in 2800 milliamp hour battery so all you have to do is plug this thing into the socket on your car and use it as you normally would with the USB ports but if you're on the go you're leaving the car and you need some extra juice just unplug this thing and take it with you and utilize the 2800 milliamp hour battery inside it's pretty simple to use and it's one of those things that'll just be ready to go when you need it if you just leave it plugged in into your car and go about your business and well for 20 bucks it's pretty awesome now I'm sure you guys saw that pretty sweet Acura TLX that I've been driving in and while this isn't under 20 bucks Acura was cool enough to let me use this car in the video which actually features wireless charging for your phone which is a pretty neat feature that we've seen in some other vehicles but the real story here is that I'm actually participating in a pretty awesome live event with Acura big thanks to Acura for being a sponsor of the channel but they are hosting an augmented reality car race in Southern California and I actually get to participate it's pretty cool so they're gonna strap me in a brand new 2018 TLX and put a helmet on me and I get to race against other drivers to try and get the best lap now I have no idea what to expect from this whole thing but if you want to join the live stream and help influence me during the race you can do so all of the details will be on the screen or linked down below in the description and I highly recommend you go check it out it's happening on July 10th 2017. All right, so next we are taking a look at some tech for your cup holder, and that is where Aki's 150 watt power inverter comes into play. And this thing is pretty cool because, like I said, it fits in your cup holder and it'll allow you to add an actual plug or socket to your car if you don't have one already. And this packs 150 watts of output, so you'll be able to charge up your MacBook, your Nintendo Switch, anything you want to plug into this guy will pretty much work. And and there's even a USB port on top of it and all you have to do is hook it into your car flip the switch on and you're ready to go with some power it's definitely a great way to keep things powered on while you're on a road trip or cruising around town and I'd highly recommend this guy finally we're checking out this crazy contraption which is actually a headrest mount for smartphones and tablets this is from a company called iCross and it's actually pretty cool because it mounts to the bars beneath the headrest on the driver's side or passenger seat the whole thing is completely adjustable and that's why I like it so much. You can adjust the size of the tablet that you're putting there. In my case, it's the 10.5 inch iPad Pro and you can completely adjust the angle or slide it side to side on the rail in which it's mounted on. And if that's not enough, you can actually move it to the end of the rail, giving you a different point of view being at the center of the two seats in the back, which is pretty cool. But if you want to find out more about this mount or anything else I've mentioned in this video, I will be sure to leave links below for you. All this stuff is about 20 bucks, so that's pretty awesome. But let me know which is your favorite in the comment section below. And if you enjoyed this video, feel free to leave it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos like this in the future. Thank you so much for watching, everyone. This is Dom, and I'll catch you in the next video.